think of this tragedy, people in our area are still coming together to send words of support down to the Orlando community. CBS 42 News reporter Alex Finney tonight live at the Magic City Wellness Center, the main drop off point for letters and cards. Hello, Alex. Hi, Jim. We know there are about 20 plus businesses serving as drop off points in this area. Now, this is something that actually just got off the ground today, but there has been such an outpouring of support and love for those in Orlando. We know that those letters are expected to be sent out on June 20th. But just to give people an idea of how close Central Alabama Pride and Orlando Pride are, when our state was going through marriage equality, Orlando Pride flooded the LGBT community here with thousands of letters and social media posts. And now Alabama, they just want to do the same. And let me tell you, it's not only people from our area that are getting involved in this drive, but also people from outside our state. This has really started to become a nation nationwide push. Um, we also have people who are out of state who are volunteering, not necessarily cards of hope, but videos to send. So we're, we're trying to work up something where people can send digital videos to the Orlando Pride. And these drop off locations are making it so easy for, of course, people to send those kind words. We actually have a full list of those locations on our website right now. Now, they have note cards placed right outside of those bins, but I have to tell you, with all the good is also coming some hurtful and some negative words as well. We actually ran across one of those notes today while working on this story. I'm going to be sharing with you that message at six and what some people in the community are saying about that message. For now, live in Birmingham, Alex Finney, CBS 42 News.